We're going to be covering speed bumps today. So whether you drive an automatic or a manual, it applies to both of you. So if you drive an automatic, you need to know what speed you're approaching it in. If you're driving a manual, you need to know the approach and the gear you're in. Otherwise, you're going to have problems. So there's, we're going to cover three types of speed bumps today. The first one is going to be the small square ones, which you can see, which are not too bad. Um, second gear, probably about 15, 20 mile an hour. You need to look at the road and assess them. And then the next one we'll come across is the ones that go right across the road, which you can see there. And they're usually around about um, 10 mile an hour, second gear, same sort of thing. And then the third one, which I call the killer speed bump because it basically kills your car if you don't go a bit too, if you go a bit too fast. And they black plastic ones right across the road and sometimes they have yellow stripes on them. As you can see one here, it's slightly worn out, just got the black plastic on it. And uh, you sometimes get them near the schools, in car parts to um, supermarkets, so it's everything's slowing right down. And you're talking first gear from two mile an hour up to five mile an hour, anything above that, phew, you'll feel it on the car like it's gonna break. <laughs> okay, so let's get some driving done and let's see these speed bumps. So, like I said previously then, we're going to be working on speed bumps, approaching them, what speed, what gear. So, if you're driving an automatic, obviously you haven't got gears, but you do need to know if you're approaching too fast for certain types of speed bumps. If you've got a manual car, then obviously you need to be in the correct gear for doing it. So, at the end of here, we're going to do a right turn, and you can see there's a warning sign on the left, telling me that on the right and left is speed bumps. Now, we're going right. So, um, it says speed bumps in 750 yards. So just get myself in position. And there's different types of speed bumps. As you can see previously, there's, there's quite a few in this area in Bletchley. And um, I'm just gonna go ahead here. Here's one straight away, a little square one, one on each side of the road. So it's gonna be about um, 15, 20 mile an hour over them ones. The little square ones. You can see ahead of us there. It's all about looking at the road look at what's happening so I'm doing 20 mile an hour I'm in for second gear sorry and I'm doing lining my tires up both sides it's easy as that I want to go in third gear I'm getting a bit slower as I get to this one here these ones here are 10 mile an hour so I'm checking slowing down ones that go straight across you see it's quite steep it's bricks on it it's quite a big bump that and I'm back on the gas, building my speed back up. So it, that, one, that one's still second gear, and this one here, same sort of thing, little square ones, 15, 20 mile an hour. You, you've got to look at them, really, and just weigh up, can you go over that speed? If it looks like it's quite steep, then you might slow down a bit. So it's all about um, forward planning. The one ahead of us, 10 miles an hour, it's quite steep. Slowing down, using my brakes, bringing my speed down. But I'm staying in second gear doing this. I'm not popping to third gear, you know, it's not worth it, they're too close together. You know, I'm building my speed back up, checking what's going on, and I'm just taking my time, 20 mile an hour, 18 mile an hour, it's nice and easy, nothing too tricky. And that's all you gotta keep saying. If I went over that too fast, I'm gonna damage the, the, the under part of the car somehow. I'm gonna damage the, the bumper as it goes down. That's it, 10 mile an hour. Even that was a bit, felt a bit steep. Checking to move right, going left. And as I'm going down here, I'm just looking ahead of us, and we've got a zebra crossing with a speed bump on it. So I'm just gonna follow the road ahead. Looks pretty clear, I'm covering my brake. There's a car coming, because I've got a priority sign there. And even though it's not, even though it's going straight across, it's not that steep. So it's just, some of them are quite smooth compared to others. So I'm in second gear, doing a right turn. Traffic's going left, that makes it easier. And this is what you gotta keep remembering, you're constantly looking up the road, looking what's ahead of you, looking do you need to go into um, third gear or and so on, what speed should you be doing? And uh, if you're not paying attention to what the road is ahead of you, you, you you're gonna approach the, the speed bump in a high gear.
So if you like the um, the video, by the way, feel free to, to like it and share it. Um, and just around the corner here, you know, right to get out, there's what I call one of the killer speed bumps, what's coming up. So I'll just slow it down because it happens pretty quickly. In fact, there's two of them, I reckon. So as we go around the corner here, right across the road, two black ones that the yellow's been worn off. So I'm slowing right down for first gear. Because if I go over it any faster, I'm gonna damage my car. And I'm on the brake, on the clutch, and it's gonna slowly. And we're talking, I'm looking at the speed there, five mile an hour, and the car's bouncing around at that point. So like I, like I said, if you're, if you like the videos, feel free to, to share them. Uh, if you think you want me to make a video and you think it's going to help you, leave a comment what you want. And if, if I've not done it, I'll consider doing it for the next few weeks. Take care, safe driving and good luck with them lessons.